Simon, this is Alice. I'm、uh, great to you know, uh, say something for today because today was the last week of ICAX 2023. So this will be a ceremony for the whole year. So today we got so lucky to have everyone on this stage. Let me introduce one by one. So first, let's be Alice. So from Beijing, ah,、uh, hey, I'm here. I'm here all the year with you. So this is my best partner, Paul Vis. So Paul, are you here? Yeah, please. Yes, I am. Yeah. With yeah, welcome everyone. <laughs> yeah. So Paul, welcome. And、uh, Mingyue, are you here? Yes. I should change my background.、Hi. In Switzerland, it's covered with snows already. <laughs> yeah, Beijing snow too. Yeah. So, uh, Martin. Hello, hi everybody. Yeah. So, welcome, uh, Fu Lan. Hi everyone. Greetings、yeah. from、yeah. nice summer here. <laughs> yes. Also, very later evening, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's Paulo. Hello, everyone、uh, from France. Welcome. Okay, yeah.、Uh, welcome, Paulo from France, and、uh, Zhong. Are you here? Hi, I'm actually from Beijing, but Alice <laughs> is in Guangzhou. <laughs> yeah, enjoy the snow there. Okay, and、uh, Chris. Yeah, big snow. Hello, everyone. Great to have you. Greetings from the Netherlands. Good. Okay, Miso. Hello, everyone. I'm here from Korea, so good to have、okay. you again. <laughs> yes, really, really great. Today we have such a great family, you know, go together on I can X. I think you know, and、uh, this year's very beginning, everyone sees these pictures and feels okay, exciting. So for twenty twenty three, Alice,、uh, you know, yeah, Alice, you know, flowing all the words because this was a year of、uh, science going around the world. So we are going to have, ah,、uh, that time we say that we all have a hundred countries, thousand scientists, you know, millions, you know, ah,、uh, audience from the whole world. So yeah, we have this word. I remember that I read this on the stage. I say we are going to put more efforts into promoting young scientists, ah,、uh, especially someone from the undeveloping areas. So we have this youth talks, you know, and Tuesday since this twenty twenty three. So what we did for this whole year? Let me give you a brief summary. So this was I can ask talks a calendar. I. Since that time, I already show this. This was a whole years, you know, ah,、uh, the plan for every Friday. You know, we have a、uh, many many super names will be added on the stage. Let's see who already on here and what happened this year. So this was the first,、uh, you know, week we have the opening with the young scientist. They all win the, you know, award of last year's young scientist award. So we got a big start. And、uh, then coming with you know super names Antony and、uh, Nicholas and、uh, Rafael and、uh, we have young scientists again and、uh, March yeah we have、uh, you know a、uh, speaker Frederick was from Italy we have Angel was from New York we have Patrice from France we have Kelly was from Australia. And、uh, and、uh, April we have young scientists start、uh, you know ah、uh, for the first week yeah we have all these young scientists here and we have a Feng Xue from、uh, Tsinghua we have Sarah from、uh, Antwerp ah、uh, we have、uh, you know Kim from Tokyo and we have two young scientists and May you know and、uh, May the first week of May we have Mucha. We have a data. We oh so, so sorry here. We have a you know she and that time we got more people to going together to have a, a offline you know event, and、uh, and the May is the last week we have Martin. Yeah, talk something very exciting, and he is here too. And the June we have a young scientist to kick out. Yeah, the ah、uh, session was Cheng Chao and、uh, Matthew. And we have a、uh, Mazar. Oh, sorry, sorry. Yes, it was from Madrid. Ah,、uh, Madrid was from Spain. Ah,、uh, we have Angel was from Cambridge. We have a Brian was from Texas. 
Uh, we have a Xiao Shen Omar from Chengdu, and uh, we have a very special day and, um, you know, uh, the early, uh, the first week of July because we have Africa Day. Yeah, that day we invited the scientists from, uh, you know, whole Africa, cover a lot of, you know, countries and places, you know, to promote the health scientists and uh, what development in Africa. So Martin was a super moderator for this, you know, for this week, this day. And uh, then we have uh, uh, Francisco, uh, we have uh, Louis, uh, we have Rebecca, yeah, we have uh, uh, another day. And uh, in the first week of August is Ocean Day. So Len was put a lot of energies for this. He invited, you know, young scientists, senior superstars from <clears throat> Australia and developed, uh, you know, a very good and very deep discussions for the science there. And uh, then we have, you know, Johan was from uh, Leuven. Yeah, we have uh, the beautiful, you know, Professor Chen was from Tianjin, talk about origami, so exciting topics. And uh, we have uh, uh, Arrow was from Iowa. Yeah, very exciting topics too. And uh, then we have Asian Day. So me, so, and me, it was exciting to host the, the scientists, especially we have the first one from Middle East. Uh, remember that we have the Thailand, uh, you know, the uh, the scientists here. So it was a big topic for what we're going to have in Asia and, uh, you know, how about science and technology in all these areas. And uh, then we have Ayat from uh, uh, Israel. And uh, we have uh, Courage was from Australia. Uh, we have Lei Yan from Peking University. And uh, we have Martin for, uh, sorry, Martin Michael. Yeah, Martin was a hoster for the uh, liquid metal. Actually, we have uh, several sessions for liquid metal. So it's gone to a very hard topic on this stage because we invited several uh, bigger names, you know, uh, in this uh, uh, liquid metal area, uh, where they play talk. So uh, then we have uh, Marcus and uh, I have a demo. Yeah, we have a uh, rising stars of light, you know, got the young scientists from, especially photonics field, you know, to get the final defense on this ICANX stage. Uh, of uh, exciting as, you know, <clears throat> that day we have, uh, uh, this was uh, American day. Uh, Paul was a host of these wonderful sessions because the scientist was from Mexico. Uh, remember that the super ladies was talking about this, you know, bioprinting as a super smart genius, you know, delivered talks. And we have a Len was from St. Louis. Uh, we have a Yuri was talk about, you know, ori uh, or not origami, organic, you know, uh, the electronics is a super topic. Uh, then we have a Hongbo uh, talk about the super, you know, laser printing. And uh, we have uh, Professor Awesome was to talk about, uh, you know, maps and uh, from bottom up to uh, bottom up and top down to develop the more things, you know, in the bottom. And uh, then we have a young scientist, uh, you know, this super three super yeah, young scientists who from different parts uh, uh, give deliver wonderful talk last week. So yeah, oh, we're so excited, you know, for this I can ask every Friday's talk. But I tell you that we also have uh, one more great things happening this year was uh, a use tax. This use tax, we named that for the young scientists shaping the future. It was taken and every Tuesday. So this Tuesday talk is a little bit different. It's, you know, we have this as a bio language. One week in Chinese, one week in English. So you see the uh, blue one was in English, you know, the yellow one was in Chinese. So you invited like a groups, the scientists, they from, you know, different part of the world, they are in the same topics, you know, to deliver the talk online. So uh, Martin and me and also Deep was a host of this, uh, you know, the first session. We're so excited, you know, Ludwig. Uh, we remember him, you know, deliver a talk for the transparent soil, use the nanoparticles. That's really like 
providing all this, you know, start uh, all this youth talk the stage. So we have uh, this and every Tuesday since that day, this was a flex uh, simple electronics. Uh, this was a talk about the electronics too. And uh, this was about, you know, a female scientist the highlight. Uh, we got so still uh, several scientists from different parts. Uh, we have this uh, was a host for the triple electrical generators, the peoples also, you know, from uh, three continentals. And uh, this was a very lovely talk because all these scientists was, uh, uh, this one was from Thailand. And uh, uh, the super uh, ladies was a talk and, uh, you know, all this, uh, Female young scientists really, really, you know, give a lot of energy on this stage. And uh, this was to talk about the materials. And uh, this was to talk about the emerging technologies. And this was another talk about advantage, uh, advanced materials. And this for the nano, <clears throat> Uh, na uh, nano-photonic, -photon you know, platforms. And uh, this was for the flexible electronics. Uh, this was for the, you know, emerging devices. And this was a biosensing, you know, talks. And this was uh, another talk about biomimic. And uh, uh, yeah, this uh, this super you know groups was talk about uh, flexible uh, manufacturing for sensor and robots in the healthcare. All these hot topics, and uh, this was get several scientists you know from different areas to set up this for uh, you know new field like thermal photonics. And uh, this was for intelligent soft material and devices. And uh, this was, you know, a uh, super, super, super nice ladies, you know, uh, for the electrode and electrolyte interface. And uh, this was for the carbon. And uh, this was for the biomedical, you know, fabrication technologies. And this was advantage of biomedical electronics. And uh, this was for the uh, new marrow delivery. So uh, this was for the energy harvesting, this for the uh, sustainable materials, and this was for organic, and this was for the sensing technology, and this was a liquid matter, yeah. So, you know, we got several sessions for the liquid matter, so get a lot of attention. And this was for energy harvesting, and this was uh, molecular dynoxis, and this was bioelectronics, and this was for the biomedicines, and for the transmutation and translations, and for optical electronics, you know, metal opticals, and the biosensing, and the vaccine. And uh, this was a lesson from, you know, what they did for the molecular switch and machine. And there was some metal nanomaterials and there was also, uh, you know, uh, brain interface. Uh, this was a computation, optical imaging, and uh, this was for the coupling. And this was for the applications. And this was micro bubbles and micro systems last week. And uh, this was this week, they talk about the advanced manufacturing with fibers. So I want to mention that, you know, all these talks was delivered and every Tuesday and with a group of young scientists. Did you see anything special? Sure, you must have found that. And every week we have at least one female young scientist. You know, yeah. We have at least one female young scientist from different parts of the world to, you know, get a talk on this I can access stage. I want to deliver this message to the whole world also with these very nice pictures. Uh, I can access is exactly the platform, you know, for everyone. Welcome females and males. You know, yeah, yeah, we do want to have a more, you know, kind of scientists from different parts of the world. Also, we consider about the gender. Yeah, so we welcome all these, you know, excellent, excellent young scientists and, uh, you know, to join us, you know, because this world was open the whole door for everyone, you know, don't worry about that. Uh, so this was a wonderful year. So let's, this was a summary, right? This was celebration. So we need to see, yeah, how many things we have done. 
So this was a picture we make up today. Yeah. So for all these speakers, yeah, uh, this year, so we make these lovely pictures. Well, on ICAX talk, we have a forty-five weeks. Yeah, we have a two hundred three, a thirty-one, you know, speakers, uh, uh, panelists. And uh, on youth talks, we have a uh, forty-three, you know, uh, weeks. We have a uh, two or uh, one two, you know, two more than two hundred scientists on that. So, uh, in Xi'an, we have a uh, you know, uh, many scientists deliver talk on site too. So this was a whole year's picture. Looks very lovely. Everyone deliver talks here, and uh, this was the numbers. Before this year, we have a. Uh, Hundred eighty eight, twenty eight, you know, weeks and forty countries, and uh, you know, almost five hundred scientists. We have twenty five millions, and this year we have a uh, hundred, uh, you know, thirty three, uh, volumes. We have a uh, uh, sixty, uh, sixty seven countries and regions. We have a. Uh, Six hundred seven four, you know, uh, scientists, uh, you know, on this stage, we have a uh, two hundred fifty millions audience. God, yeah, let's see, yeah, that's the things we make. Yeah, we promise that we have more than hundred countries, and now we have a hundred seven countries and regions. Yeah, we promise we will have invited, you know, sound scientists. We now we have. Uh, Nine one one seven two, you know, over thousand scientists on this stage, and we have more audiences than we imagination. Yes, a big, a big, a big hands, yeah, for this. So yeah, this was really, really great to get all my partners, everyone, hard work, you know, invite speakers and uh, you know, uh, moderate all these sessions. I feel so proud of uh, this great teams. And uh, you may ask a question: What's it going to do next? Right? Yeah. So, so this was a talk not only for the celebration, the summary we're going to next. Oh, next year, I can ask twenty twenty four. We're going to have uh, you know use talks on Tuesday as Euro. We're going to have the talks. I can ask talks on Friday as Euro. So the program will start on the March first. So uh till December uh thirteenth because uh you know we have our shop a uh, break yeah during between yeah so uh the the highlight of next year's go summit why because we going to have a summit yeah so yeah next year we are going to have a I can ask on site event was in Davos so we have this I can ask. The Davos summit and July 11 to 12. So I uh, will be in Switzerland. So what are we going to do there? As this is my team. So Paul, yeah, please enjoy our. You know, you translate. Uh, introduce our team. <laughs> Very good. Yeah. So I think uh, most of these people are familiar to those of you who've been attending. Of course, we have Alice, who is uh, the organizer and uh, founder of everything. And let's please thank her for all the work she's done uh, since the start of, of ICANX in April of 2020. So thank you so much, Alice, for, for putting all this together for us. And then Min Yu Dong uh, has uh, put together this, this summit that we'll have in Davos in July. Uh, I've helped a little bit. <laughs> uh, and then our, our committee are the uh, our familiar hosts from ICANX, Alan Fu from ANU, Paolo Samori uh, from Strasbourg, Martin Tuo at NC State, Mizo Kim at SKKU, uh, Christian uh, from uh, Twente, Rong Chen from uh, Hua Zhang, Francesco Stellacci, who I think is actually here with me, uh, and uh, he's from Lausanne, and Zhan Huang from uh, Tianjin. So we have a terrific program. Let's move on to the next slide. Uh, planned with just spectacular plenary speakers. Uh, it'll be a mix of science, uh, technology, innovation, and entrepreneurship. So uh, we hope to see many of you there. Uh, there will be uh, young uh, rising star uh, prizes uh, associated with with this uh, meeting in Davos, and you can see just a just a stellar lineup of speakers. So 
uh, please join us there and look for more information coming in the next few weeks. Back Thank to you, you Paul. Alice. Yeah, great. Actually, uh, Paul, you invited, know, you know, a super, you know, speakers for this, and we're going to have more, you know, it's coming. And uh, Mizo, could you please, yeah, introduce our schedule? Okay, I'll take over from here. So we're going to have two days, as you can see on the screen. So as you already saw from uh, Paul's explanation, so we're going to have superstars from all over the world. Um, and uh, also we're going to have a young scientist session and we're going to have a young scientist award session. And I'm so excited to, to say that we're going to have a gala and banquet. And that's <laughs> uh, that's the part I'm very excited for. <laughs> so, And we, we are going to have so many award parts. So as you can see from here, so I hope to see everyone from all over the world in Davos soon, very soon in a few months. Yeah, it's great, you know, that I mean, you was prepared, uh, you know, very surprised for our gala and banquet. Yeah, yeah. so we're going to introduce <laughs> that later. And uh, yeah, this was a uh, parallel sessions. And uh, I think, you know, uh, I would miss all. Yeah, I will take this. I'll, yeah, for this, yeah, the parallel sessions, we're going to have, you know, the topics in very quite, you know, wide, you know, field, uh, not only for the technologies, the science, and also we're going to have innovations. Yeah, we're going to have entrepreneurship, so we're going to have uh, all this management and uh, investment, and we try to put the things together, you know, for the people. People's, you know, from more science, from innovations, go to the uh, market entrepreneurships. So that's why, you know, we're going to have uh, several awards for this tax. So we have a uh, innovation awards, young scientist awards, and the startup uh, startup awards. So let me first introduce this innovation award. So in innovation awards is meaning so we try to in nursing all these young net generations, you know, to, uh, you know, deliver their kind of great message in the project, you know, for the innovation. So they welcome all these, you know, students in the college level to apply for these awards. So the committee so was cover the whole world. So yeah, please apply this online. Uh, so for next will be our Young Scientist Award. Yeah, Martin, please. Uh, yes, uh, for the Young Scientist Award, we're going to follow this uh, very similar format like we've done before. We will ask you, we ask that all the young scientists to apply. If you go to your PhD after January 1st, uh, 2014, please consider applying. We want to see your work. We want to honor you. We want to encourage you. We want to give you kudos for the good work you're doing. Uh, and then uh, we'll, we'll have a panel consisting of myself, uh, Chris, and uh, Xian. And then uh, we will review uh, all the applications. And then when we meet in Davos, we're gonna have the final defense there and a big celebration of all the winners. Thank you, Alex. Okay, great. Yeah, Martin, you know that today we got the first sponsor is for Young Scientist Award. Yeah, yes. so <laughs> we confirm that we already got this. Okay, yeah, Mingyue, please, for this okay. startup award. Yeah, so I think I can uh, start how far is like one step further. We focused on to find out actually the best projects or startups who can do successfully to transfer the scientists and the innovation uh, uh, technology for to the business outcomes to the real entrepreneurship uh, transfer. So here I would like to encourage all the startups actually we have some conditions but basically at least exist one year but not really <laughs> longer than five years we still to really focus on the startup uh, uh, for this uh, award and we also try to um, meet uh, uh, the the startups with uh, angel investors and also with uh, experts to help them to do this uh, business uh, the technology transfer so that's why in our committee member actually here we only have uh, uh, two person the olivia uh, browser and uh, professor antonio uh, davila so both actually they also play as an investor. Uh, Olivia is very successful. He's one of the first, uh, I should say, uh, European investor invest in, uh, in Chinese high technology 20 years ago. And uh, Tony Davila, uh, he is a very, very good uh, entrepreneurship educator. So he himself also play as an investor. 
And today I have great news. Uh, there's two experts confirmed to join this committee. So one is uh, Dr. Fei Yu Xu. Actually, she just mm. got the great news today. She became as a, as numbered as a, a Handelsplatz. I don't know if my German pronunciation is good, but it's like kind of a German uh, um, Times so cover page figure for 2023. Mm. So she is actually expert in, in doing the AI, and she successfully also run his uh, own uh, uh, startups. So she's a co-founder is a AI company based in Berlin. Another committee member is also big name. Alexandra Osteler. So if you do the business school training, almost all of the uh, master students read his book. He's the creator of this uh, business model, Kavina. Uh, so he's one of the top uh, thinkers worldwide. And he's also the author, author of uh, five bestseller books, uh, folks on the business, uh, business model building and also the innovation and also many kind of uh, management uh, books. So I'm very happy. I think it's very exciting to have this uh, award to to attract more entrepreneurship actually related to uh, high tech and deep tech. Thank you. Okay, great. Actually, me you have a uh, wonderful ideas. Later we can you know introduce a little bit of how you want to uh you know title all these words like the summit you know different summit. Yeah, very very exciting you know to hear such a strong group you know we will get a lot of you know kind of good candidate for this type of words and uh, we also open for the exhibitions. Yeah, we have a large exhibition areas. So if you are interested, don't you know hesitate to contact us. We will welcome all of you. We got sponsors. Martin, I told you, yeah, first sponsor you for Young Scientist Awards already. Yeah, there. So yeah, so we're going to uh, you know have many kind of different kind of sponsors. So we welcome everyone to support all these great event. And uh, for our contact information, so easy here. If you have any, you know, questions, go to you know contact us. And uh, for this online, also question, uh, or, or send the email to us. And uh, yes, okay. Uh, let's welcome everyone to join this, you know, great seminars, you know, ceremony. Uh, please, you know, turn on your camera and get everyone here. And uh, yeah, after you know, I uh, introduce of this great event for next year, you know, twenty twenty four, and also our summary for you know twenty twenty three. We have done. I think so proud of this team. Yeah, I couldn't hesitate, you know, to hug you even on the stage. Yeah, I feel so proud of that we made it. And uh, so yeah, uh, today is a quite kind of. Relax, you know, yeah, kind of, uh, yeah, worship, uh, talks, discussions. So, yeah, I want to, uh, kind of give, um, uh, uh, this brief introductions. I also want to hear more about, uh, you know, your experience, and suggestions, because next year we're going to, you know, go further, go summit, right? Yeah. So, yeah, why not from Paul, you know, yeah. <laughs> yes. You are um, also experienced one here. <laughs> yeah, please. Well, I think it's wonderful that ICANX has been continuing through the time as the world reopened here. So it's it's really a testament to the to the interest of of our audiences around the world and the extraordinary people who've been giving these talks and serving as panel members and the you know our young. Uh, you know, our young uh, rising stars and uh, giving the youth talks that this is this is given a, a platform uh, where we can re reach a, a much greater range of people than we can by going from conference to conference or visiting individual universities or institutes. And uh, it's, it's really a treasure. And so, uh, you know, once again, I want to thank Alice for putting all this together. And for those of you who are probably almost all of you have not yet seen the ICANX headquarters in Beijing. That's also an extraordinary place where I hope we'll continue to have have uh, meetings in person in addition to these all these online events. So thank you, Alice. Um, 
Yeah, you know, Pa. Yeah, I tell everyone your story. We uh, the first year, you know, you wake up at the three o'clock. <laughs> so yeah, especially for the young side, I see that you know never complain. You know, you know, Pa, <laughs> such a big name, also work. You know, so hard, and uh, you know, to uh, dedicate to all these new kind of new things. You know, new challenges. So yeah, you really inspire all these you know generations. Yeah, so proud of you. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. How how about uh, you know the uh maybe land you are uh, yeah, most uh, far place the warmer place. Okay, say warmer <laughs> place from Australia. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's right. So yeah, it's, it's exciting to see the very nice summary, Alice. Um. Um, uh, the same like as Paul said, um, it's great to see that um, ICANN is still going so strong. Even from this year, we um, everything back to face to face meetings, the seminars, but still, you know, we still have this great platform and attracting, uh, you know, 250 million audience. That's truly um, very uh, uh, extraordinary. Uh, one thing I feel, as you mentioned, um, I'm very glad to, to see is, um, I remember we discussed earlier this year about uh, to have female, um, you know, <laughs> presenters mm -hmm. or um, as panel members, we need to make, ensure the participation. Um, and then it's great to see that uh, you, um, you announced that for each year, uh, sorry, for, for each week, we, we do have at least one female, you know, either presenter or a moderator or, you know, um, guest. So that's, that's great uh, effort, Alice. Thank you for that. And I, I'm pretty sure um, this, we need to keep improving, uh, sorry, um, promoting inclusive and that diversity at this platform. And um, what I would like to, I, I was still really excited next year about this, um, our summit, uh, and to, to really look forward to meeting everyone face to face. I've only met, uh, in fact, the whole panel that missile this year in Korea. <laughs> it was a great experience. And I'm really looking forward to meet everyone in person um, next year at Davos. Yes, exciting, you know, a lot. Why I was in Beijing, uh, not in Beijing, I'm in Guangzhou here, because I attending, uh, you know, uh, 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 how, how to say that is a conference is for to the female scientist, uh, you know, conference. But during the conference, you know, they say that we try to prove that. I say, okay, see what I can ask them. You know, I put that this was a you know the bottom line if you don't have one female young scientist okay we don't have this session <laughs> okay you <laughs> must invite it and at least one yeah so if you couldn't find one okay alice is here <laughs> <laughs> that i tell them you know i push them out you know we have to because you know all these young scientists, all especially the female young scientists, most of them are shy. You know, yeah, most of them are quiet. So they need you know to get more kind of encouragement and you know put more efforts. So I think next year definitely we go ahead like this way. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Uh, hi, Miso. Yeah, talk about young female scientists. Yeah, I'm sorry that, um, yeah, I'm very sorry that I'm not young anymore. So I don't want to reveal my age anymore. Yeah, but I used to be a young scientist and I'm very proud to be one of the uh, early members of this I can ask us. And I cannot still believe it's been three years already. And then I, so it's, it's very like, I don't know how to describe it, but yeah, it's very, I feel very accomplished, but thanks to Alice. So thank you so much for your all these amazing efforts and support. So uh, one great thing I just noticed from the summary is that the Rising Stars, we are the Rising Star Awardees. They became, so from last year, they became the organizers of the, each session mm -hmm. this time. So it's a really a great opportunity to just uh, be involved in the first place and then they became very active like leaders of certain sessions and then so I, I think that was very pleasing uh, to see and then very inspiring so that was very good and thank you so much for these great opportunities and the other thing I noticed that is that I think I need to change my profile picture because I've used it from three years ago. I'm sorry about this. So it's not me anymore. So yeah, I definitely will change. That's one of my plans for I can talks. And 
So I was really, really impressed with this Davos things because I thought, oh, it's been three years and then what would be new? And then Alice came up with this idea of Davos. I thought, Davos, is that the same Davos I, I'm thinking of or I know? And then now it's really like coming in reality. And then we are going to Switzerland all together. So I still cannot believe it, but I really am excited to see everybody in person, especially Paul and Martin. I think we've been friends like for three years, but I have never seen you in person. So <laughs> we really need to meet. And then I think I will cry when I see everybody. So Okay, that, yeah. yeah, and then the other thing is that you summarize the whole number, the statistics about 250 million thing. So I'm sure the uh, the older speakers from this year are here with us, hopefully today, but some of them cannot see the numbers. So if you have any energy or power, uh, maybe, maybe it would be a great idea to send the uh, email to all the speakers yeah. uh, who participated this year so so that they can know the this amazing number so that we can share those numbers so yeah sure thank you yeah. so, so 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 much you're going to have a very special christmas card with all this you know oh, one yeah, yeah 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 that'd be really great <laughs> <laughs> so Miso, yeah, Paul, you may remember that actually Miso was the first group for the young scientists. Yeah, right? I used to yeah. be the first. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so you grew up, uh, you know, from young scientists. Now you are, still, you know, the young. famous star. Oh, thank yeah. you. <laughs> no, famous stars. Yeah. So uh, actually, uh, Miso accomplish. mentioned that, uh, you know, great things. Yeah, so uh, we got the Young Scientist Award this, right? Yeah, to lead all this, you know, organize mm -hmm. youth talks. This idea was from Martin. Oh, yeah. that was a yeah. great idea. Martin is a genius, you know. Yeah, <laughs> Martin. <laughs> no, I have a good mentor. He's right here, right? Uh, so so I, I actually, we saw uh, you and I came into ICANX as a Young Scientist and then we got pulled into organizing and all that. And it has been a great platform. And actually, one of the things that is not visible in the numbers is how many people are actually getting to attend from Africa, right? Okay. Uh, because, because there are a lot of young students, there are a lot of young people, they don't have the resources we have in the West and in Asia to go to conferences. But here is a platform that gives them access to really high quality uh, scientists and and it's very surprising because it, 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 you get I get an email from somebody who I have never met I don't even know who they are and they're telling me about great talk this uh, this afternoon and I'm like where did that come from so even as we think about uh, the platform that was supposed to keep us going as scientists during a tough time during the covid we have started opening doors that are not visible in the numbers and 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 I, I would really want to encourage everyone that we keep moving, we keep pushing, we keep opening those doors. Uh, actually, during African Day, I believe that's the only time we have had a politician on the platform. Mm -hmm. uh, we had a member of Kenyan Parliament attend the forum because she had heard uh, what is happening with ICANX and the role that science can play in 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 in, in moving the economy forward, and uh, what what the country was doing, she decided that she wanted to come and participate in the African. She was very brief, but I was very very touched. But even she could find time as a as a a business person, a business background, politician, sitting down with scientists, and I was like, wow, well, that's that's something else. Uh, because they're they seeing how science is um, can be a, a way to protect the social uh, welfare of the community. And, and so we are touching places that we did not intend to. So that's what is most impressive to me. Uh, to see also the Latin America uh, people coming in, that was very impressive this year, uh, getting somebody from Brazil. Uh, and I hope we can continue pushing uh, to get more people from there. And what I'm looking forward to is, um, I hope we don't just have Davos. I hope we can even have <laughs> a of in-person meeting. And one of the my dreams is actually to have ICANX in the Savannah. Uh, so if we can have even one session in the middle of African bush, uh, it will be fantastic. 
uh, so that we can show that talent is everywhere, resources are not, right? And, uh, and, and you can do science no matter where you are. It doesn't have to be that you have to be in a certain setting. And, and that's, that's what this forum has done. And uh, I can't, Aris, I can't thank you enough. Uh, Paul, I can't thank you enough that uh, I, I, I got pulled in uh, to give a talk on uh, SES Now Young Investigator. And next thing I know, I'm moderating. And now I'm, I'm, I'm all the way in. I'm also looking forward to see all of you, I, I've had the fortune at, at least of meeting Paul in person, Chris in person, and Alice. We met uh, in North Carolina uh, for the first time. So I'm, I'm looking forward to seeing uh, Miso and uh, Fulan and Mio and, other, and all the other members of the, 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 the group. Thank you very much. Okay, great. Actually, Martin, yeah, I don't have exact numbers from uh, how many from Africa, but I'm so proud that Africa's MRS, the society, was promoting I can have the talk every week. Yep. So they are very active. Yeah, they say the exactly the same words, you know. Yeah, we don't have more resources. We don't have, you know, kind of more great network, you know, to get the superstars to come to Africa. But we can listen to the talks. We can learn this most advantage, the cutting edge, you know, technologies. So yeah. also, yeah, we want to have something, especially, you know, on Davos next, you know, July. I'm going to have, you know, something for Africa. Yeah. Yeah, super, super. Yeah, uh, actually, it's really, really uh, great things, you know, to happening on IKX. We see so many people, so many countries. Now, uh, I feel so proud of that I go everywhere to every university, every conference. A lot of people come to me, Alice, I see you on I can ask every week. Yeah. <laughs> so I certainly feel that I like a superstar, you know, yeah. yeah. But uh, I know that get on I can, I can ask is really, really kind of a uh, uh, great opportunity, you know, for the scientists and also for the society to grow up. And, uh, you know, uh, this year we got a lot of uh, a uh, helper, a uh, lot of things was uh, was from Europe. This was based on the European teams, right? Yeah. So Chris and Paulo, yeah, and I uh, mean, you was really did a lot of things. So Chris, yeah, yeah. So yeah, you invited many speakers, you host many sessions. Yeah. Yeah, I know that's really great uh, to be able to help like that, and it is such a fantastic uh, opportunity also for speakers to reach. Yeah, the globe. I mean, 270 million uh, people who watch. That is an incredible number. So I'm really impressed with how quickly, how big uh, ICANX became. Uh, that is really, truly wonderful. And yeah, I got involved via Martin, right? And Martin is a very active uh, promoter of science in Africa. And a couple of years ago, we had a uh, fantastic MRS meeting in, in Africa. So yeah, perhaps uh, Africa is short on resources, but not on resourceful people. Uh, I, I was really impressed uh, what, what can be done with very little. Uh, that's very impressive to see. And and ICANX really took uh, this ideology to next level. For instance, I really like the way uh, we have organized the talks and especially through uh, panelists and uh, challengers, we give opportunity to even a uh, very young scientist to be in the spotlight and have their 50 seconds of fame. It's really fantastic. And of course, Alice, you turned this into an uh, almost a show, eh? you're really a show master. <laughs> no, thank you for that. It's really fantastic. And I think most of you I have seen uh, in real life at least a couple of times, but a few still never. So I'm also very much looking forward to seeing you all guys in Switzerland this year. Very much mm, okay. forward to it. Yeah. yeah, super. I haven't seen some. Polo, yeah, I haven't seen Polo, you know, face to face. And then France. So, Polo, please. Yeah. Yeah, indeed. So, that was uh, great that you came in May to Strasbourg uh, in your trip through Europe. Uh, and uh, I mean, going back to, to ICANX, I think is, uh, I believe, is the best expression of open science. I mean, you, uh, you render science accessible. Uh, and you render science a diversity of science accessible. So diverse in terms uh, 
not only gender, but also topic, but also geography, as, as was mentioned already by the involvement of different continents and, uh, and uh, accessible to everyone. So that I think is really a miracle. And uh, so at least we, you deserve a big applause from all of us for making this happen. And uh, so I, and I think they, it's just the beginning, I guess, with seeing all the energies that you have and all the creativity you have, I believe we will uh, face some uh, new surprise in the years to come. <laughs> yes, I have a nuclear inside. <laughs> <laughs> Before we move to, you know, uh, Davos for, I mean, yeah, yeah, we, I, I tell you a backyard story. Why we have the youth talks, you know, it's passion for young scientists. We try to move. Before we have these young scientist sessions, youth talks, actually, we have a uh, you know, Chinese version is about, you know, to push the young students, you know, the young scientists to tell the stories of science. So that idea was from Chen Rong, you know, uh, yeah, she really gave a lot of a suggestion, put a lot of energy for that, uh, you know, kind of Chinese program. So later evaluated to this use tax. Rong, please. Hi, everybody. Yeah, it's really great that for 2023, we saw, we finally got a chance to get everybody to meet offline, um, in person. If I look back for the ITX for the past few years, we saw every year it has something new, like 2022, we started to have the news talks in Chinese, as uh, Alice just mentioned yeah. at the time. Okay. Hi, you know, the connection emotional, now, depressed. Yeah, etc. So I, I personally really appreciate this. Um, I can ask help to connect everybody, just like his slogan, connect the world and the universe. A look here, I think it's even more even more wonderful because uh what we can really feel is that uh, as everybody starting to uh, see everyone off, numbers still kept increasing. And uh, as Chris also mentioned, that's X challenges give the opportunity to young scientists, to graduate students, to challenge all the super names. I think this is definitely a great opportunities. And moving forward, like for 2024, I will be able to have a chance to see everybody and also like the program itself is also starting to have more and more units in it like we are not only science but also technology even entrepreneur so well this is such a wonderful year and kudos to all to everyone to make this happen it's just amazing if you think back of all the three years thank you alice and yes, everyone it is Actually, I think that we're really proud of that we have these young scientists, you know, the Chinese program now move to, you know, uh, Chinese and English for the youth talks. It's really help a lot of young scientists, as many young students, because most of them don't have this kind of uh, can, uh, platform, don't have these opportunities. So now they get to be feelings as uh, stars because they can, you know, as a whole world can see what they are doing, how, you know, nice and how wonderful works they are doing. So that's really, really a great thing. So uh, we're going to have all this in Davos. Yeah, we're going to have all the people's, you know, kind of face to face. That time I think we'll have a lot of fun. Uh, I see uh, already say a word that I mean, you was uh, really prepared some surprise, like a gala. <laughs> yeah, we, uh, well, we, we all also will have the really famous musician. Yeah, to join our, you know, kind of Davos summit because get this art and the music and the discussions, you know, panels together. Mean you, please. Yeah, talk some. You really get to the program so attractive. Uh, I try to really mix up uh, the classic music and also with some Swiss, you know, the famous artists music. So let's see how it comes out. But uh, first, I would like to share, actually for me, 2023, I think it would be one of my, how to say, milestone in my life. 
so I'm should I should say I'm the last comer, the 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 really the new member of uh, IconX family. I still remember the first time I I, I got uh, the WeChat information from uh, from Alice, but I I missed the to meet with her in person in Switzerland. So when I first time talked to her, she just landed on Beijing <laughs> in airport. So from airport until home. She no stop talk to me about this icon X uh, ideas. Uh, so it's our first chat, even without seeing each other. I just still uh, uh, keep going, and even she talked to me in car. So that's really amazing for me uh, because uh, we talk about the innovation, science, and uh, in the. Uh, and the techno transfer, and I I also uh, share a part of the the challenge actually I facing currently in in my career, and then suddenly I just say it's time to do something, and then we create this famous it's time, and we put the <laughs> six letter each one present innovation science and uh, invest and I add investment management entrepreneurship, so it's a such a kind of how to say magic moment. Uh, uh, for me to to find out, okay, I find out where I can really have my passion beside of my professorship <laughs> in, in in finance and uh, and accounting, and the uh, and second thing I also would like to to share it's um uh, just last week I visit the uh, um, Olympic Museum, you know, I based in Lausanne, so I was invited by Qinghua uh, European alumni. They have this annual meeting, and the place is hosting Olympic Museum. Uh, so this place, actually, I have been there so many times. So when I was invited again to make the visit of the, of the I said, no, I have been here so many times, nothing new. And so they yeah, come on, just, just join. So I start again as a new visitor of this museum. And the first, uh, actually, the whole make me completely, completely, how to say, impressed. It they, they put the, 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 the Olympic game creator, you know, uh, Pierre de uh, Coubertin in French, Pierre de Coubertin. So he before they did, didn't show this. So we know they always put the the, the golden medal winners, the, the most famous stars there. And this year they put this really new from the beginning story of Olympic Games. And when I read the whole story, actually he creates this idea to let sports universe the whole world. And I said, yeah, maybe 100 years later, we have our <laughs> ITX museum to show, okay, how we can connect the scientists, the people of the whole universe. So, wow. so I, I was, I was at a wow. That's really something I should really um, uh, share with uh, our ITX family. It will come one day. The science can really make the whole universe in a how to say peaceful way. We just share our ideas and uh, uh, keep moving the whole innovation and the science in a, in a, in a kind of how to say Olympic spirit way. <laughs> so that's why I think uh, I can. Uh, I also like very much the the symbol. So uh, Olympic Games have six uh, of uh, five circles. So we have one more. We have even six circles. <laughs> it's time. <laughs> So I'm really, uh, I'm really feels uh, <laughs> so happy. All this type of uh, great ideas, and I'm really excited to to see all of you. So I really see uh, uh, Alice in Beijing person, and the rest of you, I also see you, but in your photo, <laughs> in Icon X headquarters, I know you from your photo. And uh, I just have an idea, maybe Alice, if you allow me to to make this type of uh, uh, suggestion. Maybe sure. we can create this uh, Icon X uh, first board meeting in Olympic Museum. So I will invite all you. I will organize this uh, board meeting in Olympic Museum in Lausanne. Oh, maybe nice. before, maybe yeah. maybe yeah. after, maybe before, maybe after our events. Getting if you are tired, maybe we can do after. Otherwise, if we can make this type of uh, how to say play Davos show in Lausanne, why not? Yeah. <laughs> Okay, okay. <laughs> so I will host all of you in Lausanne first, before Davos. Okay, super. Yeah, okay, deal for this. <laughs>
<laughs> yeah. So yeah, super. Actually, me you told this story is why you know we go the summit. You know, next year to Davos. Exactly. You know, it's like a magic story. Actually, I visited Paulo. You know that uh, trip for you know uh Europe. So I spent there about ten days. But I didn't meet me you at that time. But uh, when I, you know, just landing in Beijing, I got his message. <laughs> I got her message. I see, you know, yeah, that's like, you know, yeah, it's magic link. So we certainly got some uh, kind of connections, ideas, because we both from different sites, you know, I from uh, like science part, technology part, me and you also from manager part. So we got exactly the link part is for the innovation. As for how to do the education, how to benefit the whole world. So this really link all the things together. Why we use that rings? Yeah, because it's link the people together. <laughs> yeah, we try to make more things, you know, more fun. Uh, so, uh, so exciting, you know, talk about Davos, talk about the summit. I couldn't stop talking, you know, I can talk about the whole evening for those days. <laughs> oh, but time, time not allowed to, uh, you know, talk that much. Uh, but I, oh, uh, uh, you know, before uh, oh, we ending this, you know, ceremony, I see everyone was really late. It's better than almost the one o'clock, maybe. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, well, we say that, uh, uh, I think, uh, everyone, okay, use, uh, one word or one sentence to for next year, okay? For 2024, what's in your mind? You know, have a one word, okay? Yeah. We start from uh, who? Martin? Yeah. You did a mute, please. <laughs> oh, no. No, I wasn't prepared for it. Uh, I think I, I, I want to see, uh, I think growth is my word. Okay, cool. Yeah. Paul? Well, I hope in the coming year we can work together to take on the challenges the world's facing. And uh, we'll try and make ICANX a forum for laying those out and how we might proceed. Thank you. Yeah. Miso? So I think ICANX gives me the idea of dreaming big. So I'd go for dream. So dream big next year again. So together. Oh, cool. yeah. Like yeah. Well, I would just say what will ICANX next year will be full of excitement. So I would say exciting. I'm looking forward to it. Cool. Yeah, Chris. Continue to unite. There is already so much polarization in the world, but ICANX is a beautiful platform where we bring people together. Yes, freedom. <laughs> okay, <laughs> follow, please. Yeah, I think ICANX will continue to be more inclusive than it has been already. So they will bring together the entire the entire globe around science and technology to make actually also politicians realize how science is important. Thank you. Yes, we will tell them. Yeah. Well, <laughs> Ron, please. Yeah, I would say like 2024, we have extra one more day. And if we, I think of that, I would like really to get a chance to get connect with everybody. So I would put the word connect. Thank you. Thank you. Mi Yue. I still keep dreaming it's time. <laughs> so maybe it's two <laughs> words, but for me, it's one word now. <laughs> okay, yeah. So for me, yeah, my words always, you know, yeah, Thank I you. believe that, uh, yes, I can. Yes, you can. Yes, we can. I think nothing can stop this. We can, I can ask. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay, yeah. Thank you, everyone. Thank you for all these wonderful things. And uh, I think, you know, yeah, we're so proud of that we have, uh, you know, all of you on the stage, like our family here, you know, for ICANX, I think all of the people who follow ICANX will feel, you know, very exciting for next year. And uh, this was not the end of, uh, you know, uh, this year. It's, uh, it's a start of next year. So, yeah, for next year, for ICANX, for you know, everyone, please remember, keep, you know, connect with ICANX and keep together to go summit. Okay. Yeah. We're looking forward to see you next year on March 1st. We will have more fun. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. 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 Thank you
Happy so, holidays. Happy New Year, everyone. Great. Yeah. 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 Have, have, have a good night. Merry Christmas. Yeah.不再是奇迹，不再是幻想，此刻正感觉全世界离我鼓掌。不必太在意身旁惊奇的目光，可以点点头，可以放声歌唱。我创造奇迹，我拥有梦想，我希望看见所有骄傲的脸庞。再为曾经失败放弃或感伤，努力才是真的方向。I can, I can， 没有什么可以阻挡心中无限的力量。I can, I can， 你也能够像我一样飞越最高山岗。I can, I can。我可以阻挡心中无限的力量。I can, I can， 你也能够像我一样飞越最高山岗奇迹，我拥有梦想，我希望看见所有骄傲的脸庞。不再为曾经失败放弃或感伤，努力才是真的方向。I can, I can， 没有什么可以阻挡心中无限的力量。I can, I can。像我一样飞越最高山岗。I can, I can， 没有什么可以阻挡心中无限。